So not too long ago, I made a video where I was rewiring several things in my 1978 Corvette, um, but the wiring wasn't really the point to the video. So I briefly mentioned these uh, solder sleeves, heat shrink. And so I thought, you know, it'd be a good idea to come back and just address them again. Um, they're becoming really popular. And uh, some things that maybe is common knowledge by now, I don't know. But you slide this uh, sleeve over your wire, and I'll show you here in just a second. But um, the center is your solder, and these strips here are adhesive. So when this shrinks down, this um, is supposed to make a watertight seal around the wire, perfect for you know under the hood items. And so, you know, what I do here is I slide it on one side. Of, of one of the wires that I'm joining together. And so I have my two wires that I'm trying to join. And uh, I'm doing this looking through my camera, so bear with me. I'm just gonna mesh them together, just like that. Okay, and then I'm just gonna put a slight twist just to kind of keep them together. Something like that. Okay, and now I'm going to slide this over. And, uh, yeah, there we go. Just like that. So next I'm going to run a heat gun over this. I'm going to concentrate on the solder first. And then I'm going to move to the adhesive strips. And then uh, make sure the rest of it just uh, shrinks around tight. And I will tell you, you know, anytime you use like a heat source, be mindful of your background. Um, years ago, I was soldering copper pipes together and the pine board behind the copper pipes actually burst out into a flame. Um, so yeah, be mindful of your background, especially like if you're in your car or something, you might have to, um, you know, rig up some kind of a heat shield or something. But anyway, let's put this to the, uh, with a heat gun on just a low setting and see what happens. Now, this is very hot, so make sure it cools down before you touch it. Just let it sit for several, several minutes. All right, so I let it cool down for about 10 minutes, which was probably more than enough time. This is not a how-to. This is just simply how I uh, am doing it, and I just thought I'd share how I'm doing it. So um, you can see where the solder got interwoven in there. The adhesive grabbed the wire. And I'm pulling on it pretty taut, and it is not does not want to come apart. So I'm pretty happy with this product. Uh, and so that's it. Uh, if you feel like it, like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Thanks.